Hey everyone, hope you guys are doing good. Uh, today I just wanted to like reconnect on the Save Search Connect tool that we've built and we've been like, getting a lot of traction and I wanted to like reiterate how we could help you automate your save searches and dynamically connect them to like a tool like Excel, Power BI or even Google Sheets. In today's demo, I'm gonna show you how we can connect to like Google Sheets and save licensing costs because if you are only giving NetSuite access to uh, an employee for reports, for example, you could instead use the, the, use the Save Search Connect tool and have them pull this data into like a Google Sheet and then have reports built out of that and then have further automation through like refreshing it dynamically or even allowing uh, for the creation of custom pivot tables and um, custom graphs. You can also use Looker. So the opportunities are endless. You can use Power BI, Tableau as well. So for today's, today's demo, I'm gonna show you a save search that I've built. So so I have a t save search. So I'm just gonna, again, show you, showcase my, my tool. So I'm just gonna submit here. It's gonna bring me a URL that I could then put in Google Sheets. Uh, with Google Sheets, the issue is that there's a like, size limitation of uh, directly importing it as a web query link. So as a file link. So what I did is I basically built out um, a Google Sheet app, which is pretty easy. I'm gonna show you in this uh, quick demo. So the idea is, um, so let me create a new sheet and under extensions, so if I go into app scripts, so it's under extensions, app scripts, all you need to do is um, paste your URL here, right? The one which you generated from the Save Search Connect tool, you're just gonna paste it here and that's it. You're basically uh, making the script run uh, and get this data and put it on sheet one. And what this does is then like gets it and puts it here. I went in and added another uh, an additional step here. Um, like when I click on refresh data button, it's gonna refresh, run that script and refresh the data on this here, on the screen here. To further like show you this, the script is working. So I'm just gonna clear out all of these columns. Okay, let's so click on refresh data. That's it. Uh, let's see how long it takes. That's it, I, I basically have new data come through and yeah, that sheet is now connected to like this pivot table. So this is also going to be dynamically updated. So you, you can have pivot tables, reports, graphs, um, the opportunities are endless here. Um, and the way I created this button, by the way, is pretty simple. All you need to do is go into insert a drawing and then like choose a shape. For example, like we're, we're refreshing. So I'm just gonna do another one, refresh, right? save and close, have this button be put in a spot here, right? And then make sure you click on these three dots, assign script and put the name of the script, like my script is called fetch data. So I'm gonna click on okay. Um, Google uh, might ask you for to, for authentication first time you run it, but once you do it, it, um, it doesn't ask you again. So all you need to do is it's a one time uh, setup. And yes, that's it. Your data is up to date now from NetSuite via Safe Searches. So feel free to reach out to us if you want the Safe Search Connect tool to be implemented in your uh, instance. We'd be ha happy to like have a conversation, and I can give you guys a more detailed demo. So the link is in the description of this video. I'm going to put the script for this Google Sheet um, in the video description as well. Thank you all. Bye.